Hey guys, welcome back. Day 29. Um, we're gonna go, we're heading off to the trader right now. We just survived the night of, of the night of day 28. And, uh, we took some damage, but not too bad. Not too bad. The things that happened were the things I expected to happen. They did attack the garage door and basically destroy it. They destroyed the garage door. Um, but they destroyed the ladder so they couldn't get up. Now, you could do that yourself. You could take off, like, the top two rungs of the ladder or something if you really wanted to. I don't think it's that important. I do have a, a vault hatch at the top, which is pretty stout. And then there's a, there's a not fully upgraded vault door if they do breach that hatch. Now, I, I just left them open at the end, um, and someone walked right up into my house. It was kind of weird. Like, you feel, <laughs> you feel like you've been home invaded or something, that stupid zombie coming up there. But the, you know, obviously the, the bottom of the base took some damage, but it didn't, not that I could see, it didn't actually destroy anything, but it's still going to take, uh, you know, a good amount of steel to repair it. What we're doing right now is we're, we're heading toward the snow biomes and those lower traders down there to see if we can find some different stuff. We're look we're still looking for that polishing compound. Oh my I might die right here. That was not what I was looking for in going this route. I'm gonna I'm gonna actually have to heal in case that happens again. That was a big huge boo-boo. <laughs> Great. I just mark I marked this this flag point to get me over to the closest biome. See if we can actually see potassium nitrate in here. And we might I might just head down to the trader here. There it is. There it is. Anything we can sell, I'll take and scrap. There's a bear over there. This dude. I'm trying to... Alright, what's better? We know for sure that this is going to give us a good amount. And it goes through it fairly quick. Alright, so if you're looking... I think we just... We did prove that theory out that... If you're looking for gunpowder, go to like a desert is a good guarantee of coal. Go to a snow biome is a good guarantee of potassium. All right, we got to actually, we got to make our way down to the, we'll go down to this road. And then we'll take the road to the left to go through the town. And we're going to head down to those traders. What the, what did I just hit there? Should be a road up here somewhere. There it is, off to the right, I saw it. There's a town off to our left. A little chilly, got shorts on after all. I have to, some short, shorts on. <clears throat> all right, so we've got a couple, from here probably two and a half kilometers, maybe. Maybe, yeah, about two and a half kilometers, I would imagine, to get down south, where I have those two traders that I found. All right, so this town, I have to verify. I think it's this way. I think it's straight, straight south. Yeah, but the road is at the other end. Go through that. We got to go through this town, through that town. We'll end up going to that point there next. Alright, so to get out of this town, the road is at the other side of town. Do, 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 do. What building? I haven't gone into these build the since they changed the theater. I haven't gone into those. I wonder if there's anything good in there. See, we'll hit these snow biomes on the way back, checking for potassium. Potassium nitrate. It's just, it is funny. I find it funny that they made the the white rock in the snow biome. 
more of a challenge to find. It's white and black. It's kind of, you, you know, you can see it. It's not, it doesn't stand out. Like in the desert with the coal really stands out. Like, oh, there it is right there. But in here it doesn't stand out as much. So you kind of have to cruise around looking for it. Cruise around looking for it. All right, we got another town we're coming up on. Got to watch out. There's little pockets of water here. They do that a lot. Like, see how that little pocket of water on the right-hand side of the road right here? That will cost you. If you're not paying attention, you go into that with your mini bike, dunzo. You're wa you're hoofing it. You're hoofing it from that point. Got the police station there. Now this one was on the far right corner of the town. Okay, I was in this town. I think I spent a night in this town, so I went through this, but it was Jeez, it could have been all the way back like on day 15 for all I know. It was a long time ago. It was a long time ago. The cool thing is you, you get to a certain point where you don't have to... You don't have to like, oh my gosh, I gotta loot every single store. Right now, I'm pretty good on weapons and stuff. We gotta work on, on gunpowder. But there's other things I'm doing, you know. I want to finish this base. And finishing it would be repairing it and then using that polishing po compound and from there then I want to find another location to build a second base and I want to build it different right I want to build it different it could be traditional I do like the garage implementation um, but it might be garage underneath with living over the top of it problem with that is they're definitely going to break through your garage door See, the idea of putting the garage off to the side and where you stand is if you build your house over your garage, they're going to immediately come through that. They're going to be on the inside of your garage beating on your base from the inside out. And that's not, that's not good. That's not good. We should probably get a mark on so we don't go past one of these things. And we already went past that one. Trader 3, Trader 2. I want to go to this one. I want to go to this one over here. Already went past it. I'm trying to remember. I think. I, I want to say that this. The path leading to this trader was on the edge of a cliff. So we got to be careful not to fly off the edge of said cliff. Stay up here on the high side. The path, I'm pretty sure, like, oops. I'm pretty sure it was, oops, on the edge of a cliff. May, oops. I never back up far enough. Trader, please have polish. If he doesn't have polish, I might shoot over to that other trader. So I really would like to see what that does. Because after you go full steel upgrade, it is looking for the polish. And I looked in the chemistry thing to see if I could make it, and I didn't see it. I didn't see that I could make... There it is. This is a pretty nice trader, though, isn't it? The self-storage trader? Dude, cactus cereal? The self-storage trader. With it sitting here on its own, it looks pretty good. And here's the door. I don't think they can come in, but all right. I love the the building he's in. All right, Bob. I got just the thing for what's ailing you. All right, what do you got in your secret stash? He's got it. He's got it. He's got it. He's got a nail gun too. Wait, we have a nail gun in this, right? Heavy bandit chest armor. Heavy bandit chest armor. It looks like scrap armor. 47, 44. You have to do a comparison of that. All right, let's see what he's going to buy from me. Buy some clothes? Buy a shotgun? No, you like that? Cowboy hat? Huh? You want to get a little... Get your cowboy on? How about a pistol? Hmm? How about another pistol? Oh, yeah. How about another pistol? Oh, yeah. Yeah, you like pistol? Some gloves? Wooden club? No. Won't buy the wooden club. How about a sawed-off shotgun? Hey! Wait a minute. Is it going to try and take all my bullets? I don't think so. 
That would suck if it took all my shells, right? Gold. Diamonds are forever. I guess that is pretty good. 1700 for two diamonds. Want some night vision? How about some brown shorts for your troubles? I'm going to keep those BDU bottoms for myself. Sell. 40. That's pretty good. I want to sell this, but this concerns me. It can't take the whole group. It might. It, it fills up the shotgun, you know. I could have backed out and did the assemble and all that stuff. All right, so I'm going to buy 82 reinforced steel upgrades. Player vending machines, buckshot, gunpowder. 30 gunpowder. Buy that. Hazmat gloves. What else? What else does he have that might be delicious? Uh, no, no, no. Military fiber. I could probably get that from my... I think that's pretty good. Like I said, this was the main thing we were going for was this. Hmm. All right, um, we keep this, keeping this. Much obliged, stranger. No, much obliged to you, friend. Here, I'm gonna drop this. Wait, if I scrap that, that scraps for wood. I don't wanna scrap it for wood. You can pick it up after I leave if you like it so much, but you don't wanna buy it. Like, hey, that's a blue club. Should we, while we're down here, shoot straight across to see if this trader has any has any uh, steel polish because if it's any if it's anything like if it's anything like the other stuff they're, they're it's gonna be like eight, 82 of them is maybe if you're lucky eight blocks maybe it might be only four blocks because it takes like 10 or 20 polish now if it takes one polish per block that would be pretty good but it was fairly inexpensive in comparison to other things so I highly doubt that it's one polish. I bet you it's a minimum of 10 polish per block, which, what are we gonna do? You know, do one side? And you never know what side is gonna, oh jeez, oh jeez, oh jeez. That's just a tent, that's not an army base. Yeah, we're gonna have to take these at an angle. This is super steep up here. Hey, a road. I'm pretty sure we don't have this road. Yeah, we don't have this road. We're gonna go check for polish. We still gotta. I still gotta hit all those bi snow biomes on the way back. At least to get a fair amount of powder. And at that point, okay, I gotta be careful in that area. Be better to stay in this desert area, not take a chance at. Uh, Oh shoot, oh shoot, oh shoot, oh shoot, oh shoot. Alright, well, uh, yeah. I would, luckily I was turning pretty hard, pretty strong there. Um, <laughs> that could have been much worse if I flew down that way. Right. Are we above it? Are we way above it? I think, we're, I think it's down there. I think it's down there. On that other road down there. Hmm. Oh. Oh, jeez Louise. Papa Cheese. My poor bike. My poor legs, dude. I'm breaking my ankles every time. I think it's off this road here. There it is. Okay, this is another storage trader. You know, the self-storage thingy. All right. Let's check this real quick. We're burning through the daylight fast. Hey, Bob. Anything you like? Let's see what you got in your secret. Yeah, he's got some. Buy all those. Chainsaw blade. Gunpowder. Might as well buy that. Mining helmet. 
Got anything for 4800 Purple flashlight. Shotgun shells. Wait, didn't I just buy his gunpowder? Well, that was only the one that was in his stash. Um, wait, he's got... Interesting. I may have missed some in the other one because I bought out of his stash and then this is in his regular thing. So we got 102. How much does he want? 22,000. All right, we'll buy it. Whatever. We just spent. <laughs> we just spent a ton of money. Look at that. So great doing business with all. You. But all of those crazy. tokens were ones from like you know guns and stuff that we that we uh, scavenged and looted, right? All right. It's so late. I'm not going to be able to make it all the way back. So my goal is to get back to. Was this the police station? I'm gonna go right there. I'm gonna go right there and spend the night. And then that way I can check out the, the snow biome on the way back. And then we'll have to do base repair. No, I'm right here. There's so much sitting around here. I'm going to run right smack over a landmine. Ah, shoot, dude. That scared me. It scared me a bit. I was focused on looking at the ground. All right, on that note, I'm not going to collect anything because I'm on a mini bike. All right, I'm out of here. Back up to the road. Get on the road. Get on the road. Maybe... Maybe not. Get on the road, meaty. There we go. <laughs> so interesting. Okay, so we bought a lot of the of the polishing compound. We bought a lot of it, not knowing, not knowing, you know, its effects. But I can tell you this: selling stuff to the trader. There's not like a ton of stuff that you absolutely need to buy. Here's a little mini hoard right here. You know what I like to do with mini hordes? Shoot him in the face. There's not a lot of stuff that we absolutely need to buy from the trader, right? So it's not like, hey, if, you, if there is something you want, spend all your money. What does it matter? You can always get a lot more. You can always get a lot more. And if you're, you know, real trader heavy, then increase your barter skill. Your barter skill is going to increase by buying and selling anyway. But increase your barter skill if you really want better prices and... I think be more efficient for you. Wow, that thing got a little bit, a bit laggy. Hey, you guys just spawn right there? That's pretty cool. Right? Just want to get some more points. Why not? I mean, if they want to do a little reward. I ADS and I miss more than when I hip fire. Rip the dream that was easy aim. 37 Thank you very much. Thank you, thank you, thank you for your skill points. Take that stuff. Take that. In case I'm hungry. Hungry, hungry hippo. Take a little bear. Big boy! Get in here and get some water. Away from me, infected lady! Lady! She's my infected lady! We'll take that. i buy that for a dollar. I'm pretty good on food. I just need a touch of water. Because I didn't bring any with me. Fine. Fine, I'll buy it. I'll buy me some water. All the water. Thank you very much. Probably could have bought something else that would have been give me more hydration, but I was concerned about that. Treasure map! Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Alright, 1717. We better get up to... The, I mean, we could stay here, but I'd rather get up to that police station just chill in that upper room. You know? 
wait for the morning to come, do a little bit of uh, potassium nitrate mining in the snow biome, because I love having like thousands of rounds. <laughs> I really like having like gunpowder for days. That's an industry term. And right now I've been working off like five gunpowder, 15, 20, you know, make six bullets at a time. When you get to the level of using AK and using 762 and the level of using your good 44, it takes a lot of, you know, what is it, three gunpowder. So, yeah, if you do like I do and don't. I mean, if you're going to carry around your AK, fine. Use it as a single shot. Or use your hunting rifle or sniper during the day. But, you know, it's like, uh, I don't want to switch. I don't want to switch. I understand that. You got yourself a purple AK or something, or blue AK? Then just be mindful of the bullets. Don't spray and pray. Because they're <laughs> they're not the cheapest. They're not the cheapest thing in town. All right, we got actually made it here pretty quick. I might want to... I haven't even I haven't even gone in this place, huh? I have not even Oh, I went in through here. Yeah, I'm gonna say. Yeah, I've been in here. Oh chain Whoa, chainsaw time, believer! Believe believe that. Believe that. So even if you don't need tools, go through here, collect everything. You can scrap this for a lot of scrap iron, right? All these things can scrap it. For a lot of scrap. Try saying that three times fast. Scrap for a lot of scrap. Just go in here and grab everything. You can scrap it down if you don't want it. There's another purple wrench. Oh my goodness. Right. Scrap this. We'll scrap this. Scrap this, this. Throw those away. I want this. I want that stuff for sure. I have gas. Not like literally IRL. He's got gas. That jingle, jingle, jingle. Let's get to the police station. Get to the police station, man. I don't know how good my axe is. That's why I was... I, I burned the, the orange axe. Not necessary. But anything like blue or higher, keep it. Unless you know that your axe is better. But I can... Double up the axes, get myself a good axe. Once you get to that point, the thing is... Whatever level it is that you can make, you can repair with what you can make. It's just getting to that level. So it's worth using up your inventory slot to keep it. Yeah, I bet you, I bet you I could make it all the way home. I bet you I could make it all the way home. I'm actually no, I don't want to make it home because I want to search the gunpowder. I mean the uh, dacian. All right, it's good. We're gonna have to get get that stew out of our inventory because <laughs> they will absolutely, positively come up here and eat our faces if we don't. Just put it in the cooler right now. Get rid of that. We should be fine. All right, so I'm going to search up here. I'm going to chill here for the night, and then we'll... All right, my gun's broken. And then we'll come back next episode. I will see you guys then.